lot 247. There's a utility box right there on the left, and you see the little flag in between. That's the beginning of the frontage of the property line for 247, and it goes down to you see the green box there and the flag just to the left of it. That's the front. The one next to it is 246, and that's out here where they all are. And then this is the trees in the background. That is, these are called wetlands, Johanna? Yeah. Which means that they can't, uh, they're not allowed to, can't even touch it. Can't touch it to, uh, you're not allowed to touch the trees. So that, that would be in the back. Oh, and that's, by the way, that's the North Carolina blue sky. Yeah. By the way. And that's a plane in the air. Yeah, and that's the plane in here over there. The plane that you were used to get here. Yeah, hey boss, the plane. 247, 246. I mean, you, so you got those boxes, you live with it. You put something around it. But this one... And 248, the one next to it is sold. That, that one would have been... This is a cul-de-sac, obviously. Then you gotta decide if you wanna face the cul-de-sac into the street or be on the side like 246, where you're not facing the street, you're just facing the cul-de-sac. Now I'll show you from the front. Oh, and by the way, here's Hunt. Say hi, Hunt, to Jen. Hi, Jen. Hi. Hello. All right, so you come up this cul-de-sac, and then here's 250. That's But you got, and you got street lights here too. But you got, this starts 248 right here where that flag is. And that flag is the border. And you see trees, but those trees can be banged out on the property side, but not on the protected side. This lot here, 248, is sold. I'm, I'm giving Jen a tour. This is uh, the beginning of 247, yeah. going back, there's the number, then on this side you just have that little green box there at the beginning. Alright, and then you see where that silt fence is back there, that's the end of the uh, area and that's the protected area. And the other one I think is kind of cool, but it all depends on the uh, way it gets laid out. There's 246, and you see you don't have a box, utility box on your side there. You don't have a utility box on your side there, although you do have your power box. In this distance, when you come back, look at these cool trees that you That's a North Carolina, Carolina blue sky. <laughs> Say hi. Oh. Your thing is broken. Hey, what is thing? Your key is pushing the button to open it. Oh, uh, no. Close. That's hey, Blitzy. That's Charlie. Hola. Say hi. That's Peter. Peter. <laughs> All right, Jen, just, you know, so you get a feel of being long distance. Bye -bye. All right. This is the style of the one Peter likes. The white 
brick is not what he likes. It's more like any one of these other options you see here. All right? This just happens to be one that's sold already to the Faulkner family out of Wilmington, North Carolina. But that's a place for parking the truck. Big place here for two cars. Two, two car garage. You can pay an option to get that out further to the left here and make that a three car garage. Nice archway with the keystone. Don't worry about the color. That'll have a finish on it. Oh, by the way, again, that's a North Carolina sky. Hey, all right, I'm, we're going into the house that is going to be kind of like the, the one that I'm looking at. I'm going to take a film of the descent here. It's not the white brick that's outside. So when you come in, you see down there right now in the foyer. And this is uh, certainly not done yet. This is someone yeah, else's this, house. This, this is, is just yeah. by the layout. Is she getting it right now? No, 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 no. I have to send uh, it through YouTube. All right, so the, the crown moldings and everything in here, they spray paint everything first. All right, sorry because it's dark, but it's because it's the uh, realtor is letting us in without this being done. There's somebody already owns this. Let house. me show her something. Yeah, go ahead. I'm on the phone, and we're going to take something. Here is the kitchen, right? So this wall, I would have to take this back to here so that when you're in this area, you can see right through to the whole kitchen. Oh, okay. uh, yeah, that's what I'm doing. Yeah, he's talking. Yeah. So You'll be able to hear him tell when, he, when he's doing it. I'm just showing it. And it comes around and, uh, nah, and it's, it's, it's a it's peninsula. Right. Keep talking, Peter. Yeah. So on this side, this would come out. So you'd see more, and it would feel bigger looking from that side. And all you lose is one cabinet, yeah. but you got plenty of cabinets. And you know all these, all the options in here. You can get you know different tile backsplash, different cabinets. The, the the lighting is included, like you know really nice lights that you can put throughout the house. Um, the, the wallpaper in the bathrooms, which we talked about. Um, here, this is the laundry room, which... This, looks, this will look familiar to yeah, you. Yeah, she don't, she don't like this, but this is it. I mean, every house has this. Coming in from the garage, it's the laundry room. In every house, I mean, so... Um, Sorry it's dark, but this they don't have power yeah, yet. Here, come here, come in here. And this is the garage. Yeah, this is the garage. You know, pretty decent size. But this... And then we can also upgrade the garage and make it bigger. I don't know if you're going to find out how much that was. But this is a bonus room in the garage that also has AC and heat, you know, to store extra things in here. We have so much stuff. We can put stuff in this room. And this wall that's right here, I, I can take this door out and, and, and open this up and do whatever, you know, or you could just not put the wall in at all and or make it a three-car garage by extending it out. Yeah, you could get a three-car garage and, just put in it, but, and not have this wall. Right. Um, oh, and that's a North Carolina sky right there. All right, here we go. Out of the garage. Like For a three-car garage. You get a three-car, yes. and it would cost more money. Right. How much more money? I'm going to keep going because he's asking questions. Uh, All right. This is the kind of ceiling you get, and this is like a dining room, but it's like a semi-formal because it's not a separate room. This is uh, one of the smaller bedrooms. It's kind of hard to see as I go close to it. It's got its own bathroom here, but it's also in a hallway. Could could be a common area bathroom. It's a half bath, it looks like. Or this could be a study or a or a, an office. All right. So we're going this way. Show uh, 
Show Jen the... No, no, no. Show Jen the master and go that way. I'm, I'm more dramatic. I'm like Steven Spielberg when I do this. Uh, so a little closet here, I guess, for a couple coats or whatever. For people yeah. when they come in, you know. Yeah. Uh, this is uh, French doors going into the master bedroom. Yeah. I mean, too bad we didn't take pictures of the, this uh, way. the other one. Oh, that way? Oh. Yeah. Now, this yeah. is the master bedroom. Yeah. Well, and you'll see the actual uh, specs so you can get an appreciation for what truly the size is. But it's pretty freaking huge. And this would be, this would be the, this is the other room. This comes off of the master bedroom like a sitting room, but could be the office as well. Right, and this, this is going to be bigger in, in, in the other one. So this in the other room. one? Well, yeah, six more feet. Oh, if you want, got, if you got a bigger one. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And now from this office, you can go out or from your sitting room as a bedroom, sitting room, you go out to the back indoor patio deck or it's, no it's a patio with a screened in, and here, in North, and here in North Carolina you actually use this three quarters of the year if not more and here three skylights and this is outdoor living this doesn't count as part of your square footage for heating and over here you got a little wet all bar from floor to ceiling wet bar yeah, this is all this, this is all 100% Plastic, so it never rots. You have yeah. it in the sink. You have stuff in here. You can put a TV out here. This this area, from a video, it's hard to tell, but this area is freaking huge. And then, and, and this is based on the lots, so. this you saw the lots in the other video. This is, and would you say, Peter, about the tile? I said this whole floor is going to be tiled. Whole floor is tiled. Be tiled. Yeah. So let's go this way. Can you go this way? No, it's locked. Like All right. So this way is the way you came in yeah. from the main Triple living doors. room. Three doors open out of the four, but they all four slide either way, left so or right. So it's a huge opening yeah. to the house. Yeah, what you can leave open in certain parts of the year, you know, with, for entertaining or just hanging out here. This is amazing, the size of this. Okay, so we're going back through the uh, sitting room or office to the master bedroom. You get a little archway right there. You know, that's where the master bed goes, where all the magic happens, right there. And then... Then two closets, one here. Oh yeah, and then two, two closets, a his and hers closet. That's a huge his, or hers, whatever. And then this one would be mine. Then there's the his, that's a smaller one. And now... Linen closet for the bathroom. Linen closet, there's a... The hers. And then a makeup area. Giant mirror, the way she wanted, with the molding. And then the mirror goes inside of this. Yeah, and then, this is the guy's side. And then, here's the shower. The shower, it steps down into here. And, and two controls, there'll be a rain, a rain head here. And, um, and it doesn't shower. need a door, no door at all. You just walk in. Shower and now this you could probably option out of right here and do something else. Yeah, the toilet back there. If you're not interested in another big tub. And there's the poop dose right there. Okay. This won't make make sense just by watching the video, but when you compare it to the plans, it'll make sense. Now, the distance from here to that far corner where you see in the middle of the light. That bedroom or that little office or bedroom, the really small bedroom over there, that is an amazing distance right there. It's hard to tell from the perspective here, but it's. And if, if you did open that wall right there that's part of the kitchen, it, it's amazing how big it looks. And it's dark in here, so it doesn't look as big. All right, here we go. Again, this is the other entrance from the kitchen. This is another bedroom, right here, bathroom. which has another bathroom and a shower. Tile floors, frame around the glass. 
this is another bedroom, right, Peter? Yep. All right, this is another bigger bathroom, and this is another step-in one. You might put glass here. You might put um, uh, curtains here. Or you could even do it with nothing. You might have a little sprinkle over here, but you just squish it over. And then this is the other bedroom down here. So it can be three bedrooms or four bedrooms, however you pick it. And there's a closet. Right? I think that's it, right? So let me walk around with you. See, here we go. In here for where Jen makes the magic meatballs. Yeah, baby. Party time right here. There you go. All one on one floor. All right. Bye, Jen. Say bye to Jen. Bye, Jen. Bye, Jen. Bye. Bye. All righty. Thanks a lot for letting us come oh, back. Now, if you walk outside, Jen, look. See, you're back out here. <laughs> and again, that can be a two car garage upgraded to a three car garage. Place for the extra cars, place for the work truck and woods around you. This isn't the house. This is just the layout of the house that Peter likes. Uh, and again, the brick can be any color you want it to be. And this neighborhood is like spooky quiet. And you're real close to shopping, schools, colleges, high schools, movies, beaches, everything. Hope you enjoyed my video. Everybody has to say hi to Jen. Hi, hi Jen. Hi, Jen. Hi, Jen. What's up? Hi, Jen. Hi, Jen. 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 Charlie Wait, wants to Char go. Blitzy. I'm hungry. Blitzy. Charlie's hungry. Wait a minute. got to say hi to, to Blitzy. Say hi, Blitzy. Say hi, Blitzy. Uh, say hi to Jen. Oh, let's not forget Dilly and Daniel. And Dylan, everybody. And yeah. And how about Jedi? Oh, don't. Oh, and Jedi could be your friend. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Bye bye. Oh, and that's a bobcat, and that's an outhouse. That's extra. If you want to keep an outhouse after you move in, that way, you know, like if you have to pee as soon as you get out of the car, you don't have to run in the house that way. I'm going to take you for a little walk while Peter's gabbing. This isn't where the lots are that are open for this next phase. You saw that in the other video. But there's where everyone gets their common mail. Here's an example of the kind of extras you get here in the way of uh, um, landscaping, I guess. Here in this section of North Carolina especially, water uh, retention ponds are key. And that's why everything here happens to be um, HOA associations because everyone has to share in the uh, maintenance and engineering of the water. So right back here, here's an example of one of the benches. And this is like a little neighborhood with common area. You can have that black fence you see there. And that's an example right there. That new section that had the cul-de-sac has its own features. But besides the uh, workout room and that kind of stuff, there's sections where there's going to be playgrounds and all that stuff. Bye-bye.